guys, welcome back to another video. So, kind of broke my promise a little bit. Um, we need to get things moving here because planting season is becoming extremely um, ominous. And right now, the combine is currently sitting in the way. So we started work on it. It took all hands on deck and it was extreme, like it was an extreme pain in the ass to be honest. And sorry if I forget to edit that out, it just, it's just in there. Um, so essentially what I had to do, being the smallest one in the entire uh, hoorah up here, the bearing here for the shaker is, or the screens here is, these bolts are screw heads like this on the inside and you have to take a screwdriver on the inside and get to it. Well the only way to get to that is to actually climb inside because you can't take these panels off. This panel has something mounted to it and it's blocked on the inside anyway. And this pro uh, this panel right here is uh, has frames on it, frame mounts on it and it would have been pain in the ass to get it out because of this other drive back here. So what we have had to do was I had to climb on the inside of the uh, combine in the back. I'll show you that here in a second and uh, unbolt all these and then go in front uh, above the rotor to undo this one. And let me tell you, it's not something I'm willing to repeat. So the other thing is we were gonna get this back together and the bearing or the bushing that was on there was not pressed correctly. So kinda got screwed over there. I climbed into the rotor for no reason, but um, the bushing goes in here and it should be offset by about a quarter inch and it was not offset, it was flush, so the, the, it was twisted and it just wouldn't go in right, so we just took it to have it, have it uh, repressed, and we are hopefully gonna get the bolt in soon, and that way I don't have to climb back in the rotor anytime soon, so that's a quick update on that. I, other than that, we aren't gonna really do much about the front feeder house yet, we have to either take it in or do it ourselves, and if we do it ourselves, I'll try to film it, if not, then um, so be it. I, I can't really promise anything right now. I'm just trying to roll out videos every day as much as possible because I want to keep everybody uh, entertained and just kind of do it for fun. You know, I want to try this out with the everyday thing. So um, outside of that, I know I haven't posted every day uh, because I just I can't. I, there was a little bit of a, a shortage of time the other day and I couldn't do it. So. Uh, the other thing is, my videos are going to be less edited. Uh, I'm not going to put bleeps in there as much because it's a lot of work to actually do that with the editor that I use. And additionally, it's kind of hard to work with uh, videos and make them extremely edited because it takes time. Like it takes about an hour or two to film a video and it takes about four or five hours to edit the video. So uh, it, it's just easier for me just to film it all in one go or film it in pieces and put the pieces together and post it because that's just what's quickest for me and that's what is going to get out the most content at a time and I have other things and other responsibilities that take a lot of energy so you know what this is easiest this is what we're going with and hopefully you'll stick around I'll stick around for it so anyway what we have now is the combine we're going to combines on the charger because I've been using that little light right there for the inside and the inside I said I would look at it I put a piece of plywood down I put a piece of plywood down over the grates there, and I had to climb in the back there. And you can't really see it, but um, we had to drop a, 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 a fan in the back, and that was it. And then on the rotor, you just got to climb in up there pretty easy. All right, guys, had a little bit of an interruption there. Um, anyway, like I was saying, we got the rollers on the planter. Hopefully, we'll be planting soon. It is drying up, and it's getting warmer out. You can see I'm in a tee. So, anyway. Um, go ahead and leave a comment down below about what you guys would like to see. I'm kind of trying to put out as many videos as possible, so there might be a little lackluster on content, but I want to get out as much as possible. Um, don't forget to show your support by liking and hit the little bell so you know when I post. And don't forget to subscribe to, well, show your support for me. So, anyway, thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you in another one.